Zachary Jackson and I'm Rosharon Jackson Cotton and we're located here in, in Houston Texas in Midtown at uh, not just on us bakery 2020 Massapation Avenue I got started uh, here in 2000 December of 2000 uh, after working in a grocery store bakery for four years and I saw how people were really enjoying the, the baked goods so I was wondering what kind of uh, business could I start? I knew I wanted to start a business and I had to start a business. It, it was like something I had to do. And I saw how people were really buying baked goods. And I thought everybody baked at home, but no, <laughs> I learned different. I wanted to taste tea cakes. Those are things that I grew up on. My aunts and uh, my grandmothers, they all baked, good bakers. So I was used to that home baking, but uh, no one was doing it. I could find it nowhere, so I decided that I wanted to do that. So this is what we're, we're basically known for, the home style baking. Right now, one of our most popular things is the sweet potato pie. That's my mother's recipe. Uh, we have tea cakes. That's my great grandmother's recipe, which is over 100 and maybe 125 years Oh, and it was passed down, and I'm going to keep that legacy going. And another uh, customer favorite is the billionaire's cake, which is yeah. a sour cream based cake drenched in cream cheese icing, so rich. So a, a customer of ours actually gave us that name, billionaire, because it's just a sour cream cake. But he said, "Oh, it's so rich, you should call it billionaire." And so that's a that's another favorite. It's, it's addictive. I must say, it's very addictive. So, yes. but it, it's good. The name that we came up with, Not Just Donuts Bakery, was something that my daughter Bridget and I was kicking around uh, names. She, she would just call off a lot of different names and Not Just Donuts was catchy. She said, well, it's very catchy. You know, it's something I think people will remember. And in the original, it wasn't supposed to be meant to be cakes. We have been just doing pastries like donuts, breads, rolls. But it was an existing bakery here already. So when we came in, they actually had orders for Christmas. So that's how we started to do cakes, add cakes to it. The cakes took off faster than the donuts and the pastries. So that's what we, the name stuck and we, <laughs> the name stuck. So not just Donuts Bakery, but we do cakes and more. Yeah. Future plans of Not Just Donuts is to get our product in a grocery store adding wholesale baking, uh, especially the tea cakes and our oatmeal raisin cookies. We, we want to get those in a grocery store, uh, our online store. We want to sell more online. We're, we're doing it on a very small basis, but we want to want that to grow. So we uh, plan to do that. I, I have a plan to even start a baking school. I, I would like to do that to teach young especially women. I want to reach young girls, young women, to give them a skill. Uh, and baking would be a good skill for them. And also it could be a place where we could employ. I could see people that I need. Other bakeries could also, you know, come and hire these people as well. So I think that would be very influential in, in you know, in a neighborhood like this. Again, my name is Myrtle Zachary Jackson. And I'm Rosharon Jackson Cotton. And you can find us at Not Just Donuts Bakery at 2020 Emancipation Avenue. Our website is notjustdonuts.net. And also on Instagram at Not Just Donuts Bakery. Come by and see us so you can experience the taste of heaven. <laughs>